certain times of day, demand for energy is high. This puts a strain on the power grid and our energy sources. Reducing electricity during these times helps keep the grid balanced and helps relieve this strain. Balancing the grid this way is called demand side response, or DSR. The challenge with domestic DSR is the lack of engagement. Turning things off is boring, and there's not much money in it for the individual. Why would you turn your washing machine off for 10p? The solution? Again. The Gen Game was created to provide incentive, drive consumer engagement, and acceptance of DSR with a realistic budget. Here's how it worked. Specific network areas within Northern Power Grid's region were targeted with Facebook marketing. Users downloaded the Gen Game app for free on iOS and Android, and sent self-installed smart home devices in the mail. Once set up, players were notified by the app at peak times or Gen Game times. The more they reduced their energy use at these times, the more points they earned. These points were used in competitions to win real cash prizes. Prizes are a great incentive to reduce energy, but will people play for fun? A compelling game called Gen Blast was designed to incentivize energy reductions. It gave suggestions for how players could reduce energy in their home. Players reduced their power until they were ready to play. If power was kept low during the game, special items appeared, making the game more rewarding and creating more opportunities to score higher. 2,000 people took part in the Gen Game over two years. There were 327 DSR events. Top players participated in 98% of these. Some homes made reductions as big as 4.9 kilowatts, turning off electric vehicles, tropical fish tanks, caravans, and hot tubs. Over 30,000 games of Gen Blast were played, over 900 hours of game time in total. The average time per game was 100 seconds. That's longer than most people look at their energy bills. There were power reductions of around 11% per home. With a chance to win up to £350 per month, this worked out at only 44p per player for taking part in a DSR event. That's about 20 times cheaper than similar non-gamified projects. Traditionally, DNOs reinforce the power network to address issues. As our energy needs evolve, it's too expensive to keep following this approach to supply increasing demand. Newcastle University is looking at how the Gen Game can be used to help solve network issues by creating domestic flexibility. Download the reports to find out more.